Esther. I'm from the City uh, English Language Center at City Lake. And I am here to share with you my experience of using technology in class. Um, before that, I noticed most of us, uh, the speakers earlier today, we all mentioned how we want to design our materials that could motivate students, that could get them to talk in class, talk to each other, talk to the teacher, respond to me in class. So we, we were all thinking about this. This seems like a main, one of the main themes that all of us had in mind. Um, I want to understand you guys a little bit more, so what I invite you guys to participate in a very short survey. It's a bit like the mentee meter, what's it called? The mentee meter kind of thing that we did earlier today. Uh, only three questions, this would not take too much time. I promise I will keep, keep time. <laughs> um, so if you could take your phones and go to kahoot.it, that's the website. And there would be a game up there.
you guys are trying to crack jokes that only you can understand. Yes, that happens to me too. <laughs> All right, thank you for participating. Um, this, the point of this, I want to know how you guys, um, or what the challenges are when you come up, when you're given uh, course materials or a unit to teach. Um, how can we make it more challenging? I think uh, more interesting, I think that's the main struggle that I face as a teacher and from the survey it feels like you agree with me. You feel me. So um, I am going to try today to demonstrate with an example of a short uh, activity I was provided in the unit and how I try to gam gamify it with cahoots here. Um, I know some of you have already, are you using cahoots? I think some of you using codes. Thank you, Stephen. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> so um, I'm going to try and demonstrate the decision-making kind of process throughout taking a material from a course book or a unit and making it into a good uh, activity in class. And I have here the material I worked with. How many minutes One. Oh, <laughs> Uh, I can show it up on the screen. The material. Do I have a Word document that I use? It's in the phone. It's in the phone. Very neatly organized. Have a look at the reading which at the unit. This is from a course, an English course for humanities students, so uh, social science students and what else? And uh, social workers, students, political science students. On reading strategies, so on reading skills, academic reading skills, this is what I've been given. To my opinion, it's very text based and paper based. Uh, it highlights oh, there's a survey that's been done. Here are the three questions from that survey on reading strategies. In University students, what are your answers to these questions? And then the main message down here, reading was very important to students, but they often skip their reading assignments. Message, if you want to. So I take this, I feel like, uh, how am I supposed to deliver this in class? I wanted to try Kahoot, make it more interesting, um, generate discussions like we just did. Um, you choose answers, so I invited questions, invited suggestions from you guys. Um, making this into a Kahoot. So I wanted the students to actually do the survey, not on paper, and on Kahoot. I, I recycled three of these. Um, thank you for reminding me. <laughs> I recycled three of the questions and I have expanded the survey into a class poll. I added the first question of my Kahoot. I'm just going to show it on the slide so it's easier for us to go I love reading! Which answer do you think students would? <laughs> <laughs> a playful one, just to get them started and they could be honest with their answer. Then I recycled two of the questions on the paper. Um, and the point about this activity, I understood that it wants to bring out that reading is important to academic success. So those two questions related to that, so I kept that. And I have another two more questions on Another main point I think I got from the activity, which is about students' reading habits. And so I added one more uh, question to it. And you know what they answer. I read before class to prepare for a particular lesson. And then last two, I added these two in so that the questions would lead nicely to the back of the unit on reading strategies provided for students and we could add in another text for them to read and practice those reading strategies and 
then add in another kahoot, this time not a survey but a quiz, so to test their comprehension of that text. So using kahoot in a different way, and it looks like, it looks like this on my thing. Sharing earlier at City, we did have that. Okay, so that's my 